After reports that migrant children are being abused at Arizona shelters, the state is investigating the largest shelter operator. It's our big story on 12 News at 6. And tonight we found that all 13 Southwest key shelters in Arizona have been inspected over the last two weeks. Good evening, I'm Joe Dana. Mark is off. Now, the result could be state oversight to correct any problems. Team 12's Bram Resnick is taking a closer look at these new developments live from the Alert Center. Bram? Yeah, there have been calls for several weeks for the state to take action. Arizona Health Services Director Kara Chris told me today all the allegations against the shelters have been taken into account during those inspections. I also asked Chris whether she'd leave her children alone in one of those shelters. After several reports of abuse, Arizona shelters housing migrant children are getting a sweeping state inspection. Watching the news, it, it is horrifying. I can't imagine as a parent experiencing that or having my children experiencing that. Dr. Kara Christ, the state's health services director, tells 12 News her inspectors have gone through all 13 Southwest Key shelters in Arizona over the last two weeks. We took all of those allegations because they were so horrifying that we were hearing in the media. We took that as a system complaint. The most recent shocker, a former Southwest Key employee charged with molesting eight migrant boys at a Mesa shelter. I actually think we're going above what we what we normally can do. First Lady Melania Trump spotlighted a Phoenix shelter during a June visit. Southwest Key takes in a half billion dollars a year from the feds to care for migrant children separated from their parents. These inspections could lead to an agreement to fix whatever might be wrong with state oversight for up to a year. Knowing what she knows, I asked Kara Christ whether she'd leave her three children alone at a Southwest Key shelter. I'm trying to imagine a world where my, you know, where my yeah. children would be without me, and that's that's really hard. Um, but they provide good care. A Southwest Key spokeswoman said the company welcomed the inspections and would wor work with the state on suggested improvements. Kara Christ also told me the Arizona reports would be forwarded to federal officials. Live in the Alert Center, Bram Resnick, 12 News. All right, Bram, thank you.